No. Got a TV advantage. So that's something. Maybe that means he's got an amazing record. Oh God. Claw, mighty blow, claw. Mighty blow. Only one bow. But he's got mighty blow. Right, he's lost he's lost two more than he's won, that's good. Don't know if I've played these guys before or not. I did play a Oh he lost he lost four nil to a <laughs> <laughs> Who's got optimal vampire roster? Is that Shawnee? <laughs> so he's he, he beat Shawnee after losing four nil to Andy Durbo. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Zombie chart's a good. That's a good card, isn't it? <laughs> of course it's Johnny. <laughs> Optimal vampire roster, that's pretty good. <laughs> the good old Optimal Vampire roster. I don't think he's got that many players on this team, so if win the toss finally for the first time today. Um might be able to just fucking bang on him in the first half. All right, he's only got 11 guys, so I'll try and focus the hobgoblins to hurt them. Are they unskilled? I think they've all got block, actually. No, there's a loner, so I can hit him on the other one, try to hurt them. Keep the ogres together to stop the claw messing with them. He's only got one guard, and the claw might be able to hit with, so he hasn't got that much guard. Could be okay. Gonna have to carry with an ogre because of the bull. Stand firm, it's all good. All right, Shawnee trying to finally get his level up. That's good against the the bull, I guess. Right, play like there's no rerolls. Mm-hmm. 
Hmm. No blitz this turn. <laughs> Got the ball. And kill someone. Oh. Yeah, they conceded. <laughs> he saw it. <laughs> um, twelve team. They've got some good things, but they've only got eleven players. So, hopefully. Mess them up a bit. Mm -hmm. I guess I should stand this guy up there. <laughs> I guess I should have punched his uh, hobbling, hobbling, hobgoblin there, but never mind. Oh my fucking god, really? I mean, he can blitz a snotly if he wants, so it's not like I can keep them safe. Might as well all be exposed if one is. Sure, brains. <laughs> yeah, pro is the thing, yeah. Didn't make a cast, pretty good. Sure, head. 
It is a block tackle logo, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's boning it both turns though so far. So they can block, and he can blitz him three dice. I mean, uh, no, because the push is terrible, isn't it? So I don't really want to get in. I could, 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 no, I can't get him in there. Could two dice, but rather two dice would block. Yeah, get him in there. Three dice hit. We need to get some fucking removals in. <laughs> yeah, hopefully he restarts, yeah. Yeah, that's the idea, yeah. Yeah, that's the thing, like if I'd if I'd double scold or whatever. Then he gets uh, he gets the free hit in, doesn't he, with three dice with block? I think it's fair. I mean, it's not like he's really threatened to get two dice, does he? Relatively, relatively risk-free, isn't it, marking the snotling, so... I tend to do it. Block. Oh, can hit the bull to get forward. That seems good. Going very far forward now, though.
try and follow his carrier. Yes! Yes! That was a good foul. Well done. Good foul, mans. This dog's a little bit exposed to the claw blitz, isn't he? I think actually basing him would be a good move, wouldn't it? Because he's got a mighty blow on guard. He's a good guy to get based up. Oh god, yeah, I could have got Frenzy instead of Tackle, couldn't I? Oh shit. That would have been awesome. Yeah, getting clawed by him sucks. Just gonna pill block the carrier. Oh no, it's just not me. Oh, you could. Aren't I clever? No, no mighty blow, doesn't need it. <laughs> yes, Bruce McHugh, um, unfortunately, um, I'm on the laptop at the moment, so yeah, unfortunately quality is a bit shit. It'll be better in, you know, in about a month or something. In about a month. Um, it'll be alright. Yes, good, fuck you, Chorf. Ah, should have had stand firm. At least you freed up an organ, that was nice of him. Right, this is going to be pretty tough to protect the ball, isn't it? Although that's great, getting rid of him. Um... Just blitz him, I guess. Making the ball safe is tough, though. Two, three, four. Yeah. And go for this two dicer first. No. Oh. Obviously can't try to even try the GFI now. I'm, I'm okay I'm taking out an ogre to be honest. Playing him base two snots was pretty bad. Hmm. Hmm. 
Bring out his snots. <laughs> yeah, thanks, very good. I do appreciate it, to be honest, because um, I don't know. It's it's crazy how bad the quality is. I can't wait to get back on the PC. Holy shit! Yeah. Well, I mean, with tackle, obviously, basing with tackle. Um, otherwise, it's a double one, isn't it? So basing them with the with the hobgoblins isn't as isn't as good. But yeah, obviously, basing them with dwarves is uh, is absolutely good. He's just he's just blitzing a snot every turn, isn't he? He's going for the snot killing route. Um, Wow, three plus in the fucking snow. What a shithead. Oh, man, no justice. He should have died there with his armor fucking seven. Prick. So I want to block with block, don't I? And then that frees him up to do the blitz. Rather than the ball carrier. Now he's on two, which is actually pretty good, isn't it? That, that's, a, that's a nice push. Mm-hmm. Why can't I see the move all? Oh, it's because the blizzard doesn't matter, does it? Alright. No, there's no. Couldn't click skip because the fucking blizzard. That was disappointing. Um. I could just three dice him, maybe? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Try to block him first. Could try dodging away. Really want to block with him as well. It's not looking good from now, is it? And free up the ball. That was a pretty annoying bonehead there. He could dodge to there and then he could two dice the ball. That's the, that's the way it solved the ball problem. Don't want a one dice. Don't want a two, two plus dodge out really because I'd have to commit to using the reroll. Fuck it, okay, I commit to using the reroll. Oh, baby. I'm committed. Pop committed. Because the bull's just, it's just too easy for me to get hit with a bull, isn't it? At the moment. Don't really want to foul. Maybe should have done. Well, if this is going to be two minutes soon and we don't care what you prefer, is it going to be two minutes? Or what?
I didn't forget an ogre. He's occupying two guys. And, yeah, if I got the snot on the floor, then he gets punched, doesn't he? I want to dodge him. Oh, man, he's made two fucking GFIs in the snow. Fuck off. Oh, man. Try one fucking dodge with a snotling that had to work. It's a one. <laughs> He makes two fucking GFIs in the snow. No fucking problem. Oh yeah, that's oh yeah, that's a good point, BZL. Yeah, the data the data is there, isn't it? Right, so I think what makes sense is safe moves first. Just standing a guy up and moving a guy. And standing a guy up and blocking, blocking with block. Mm hmm. That would have saved us a dodge if that had been a push. Now I've got a dodge here, haven't I? And dodge here. And three dice to score. And I think with no rerolls, I just take the touchdown. And it's it's snow, isn't it? And he's lost his he's lost his sure hands guy, so he might not score. Minus two D. Yeah, he probably should have done. The best chance he was going to get. Dodging into tackle's fine, Wolf Bark, it's only dodging out of tackle. So. <laughs> yeah, I've been trying to get a level the last three games, yeah. <laughs> Looking crazy. Alright. I don't, I don't get fucked by a quick snap, do we? Snotlings. I've still got the full three reserves, even though you've been focusing snotlings. Now he can't break through the side, so he's got to go through the middle. There's break tackle guys there. He's going to have to fucking focus on this guy to block him down, or this guy to block him down. And then this splat this guy, but if it's a push he gets there. But even then, even if it's a power he gets there, he's going to have to blitz him somehow. I think this might work. Six three three are the ogres after twelve games, and the chaos are eight four zero after twelve games. That's oh, good. I just realised they're both on twelve games now. That's good, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. But Master X, that's the problem with it. Yeah, absolutely. 
<laughs> yeah, Pedro. Well, I wanted to get them up to the same number of games, and now they are. So now I'm going to have a, a, you know, try to alternate between them, even though it's been all August for, the, for a couple of days. That is because, to be fair, people did donate 10,000 bits to get the Ogres played. So hopefully the rush of Ogre games has satisfied the, uh, the thirst for Ogres and now can just go for a bit of a... Oh shit, he got the good weather. Can go for, you know, a, a mix of them now after going crazy on the Ogres. Now using his ball to block, that's good. So now his only scoring threat is Hobgoblins. Which one's a, one's a loner. No, oh, killed in his first game. No badly hurt. Sweet. Sick of these fat fucks, fair enough. I am as well, to be honest. I want tomorrow to be a chaos day. Jimmy, stop acting like you don't enjoy ogres. You love the big guys with their girth and strong arms. <laughs> you <bloody> <laughs> <bowl> coach you. <laughs> mm. oh, yeah. Thanks for the bits, Tony. <laughs> you make it 25 minutes per turn, fast would still run out of time. <laughs> Love the Tony has to run. <laughs> yeah, that's true, Maggie. I can. Yeah, that's true. It's, it has to be snappy. It, it's just dumb, really, that they've tried to make it to appeal to tabletop players and they just shouldn't have. They should have just thought, fuck tabletop players, seriously. Um, okay, well, well, this guy basically can't score. So there's only this one who can. I don't have rerolls though. So, a three dice with block is the safest way to get this guy. No. <laughs> right. So then, this is a 1 in 36 to at least... Ah, but then he's already marked by somebody. So this is a 1 in 36. Whoa. Yeah, okay. Stunned guys up. No. 1 in 36 to fail. So now there is at least a marker. Even though it's an incredibly easy marker to deal with, at least there's a marker. I think it's worth getting three dice on this guy at the expense of trying to dodge this guy out. There's no... There's no... Um, there's no dwarf there, no. So it is a 1 in 36. Obviously a fail here is terrible, because, but then he can't chain him. He's just not in range, so, so the fail isn't that bad anyway. Right, and then in for the three dice. At least he's double marked, right. And then try and mark the guy with the ball. I'll just stand these guys up in the way now then. I like how I've played elves that just fucking roll a million two pluses in a row. And I try to just make some fucking two pluses out of reroll, just fucking all fail. Just two out of three fail. Just get proper fucked. Yeah. 
Yeah, me too, but Master Rex. I think it was worth just trying to get in the way, you know, maybe get interception chances. If he doesn't remove him, then at least this sidestep does something good. Like if it's just a stun. It is just a stun. So, he's got to go two dodges and a four plus catch. Alright, he's failed the first thing, that's good. Good. Phew. Squeaky bum time. Yeah, exactly, but Master X, exactly. They shouldn't have. <sighs> I know, I know English, Yuri Styles, but it's it's easier to you know to talk with colloquialisms, isn't it? So half a chance. I mean, maybe just put the better player on the pitch now, seeing as... But he'll be going for the 2-1. He's still got to try to win, hasn't he? Surely. Surely he's got to try to win. So... Be having, having him on for the one turn would be good, wouldn't it? I think, I think as a computer game, Blood Bowl does need an overhaul. That's the thing. I think, I think definitely as a computer game. No, Pedro, I don't think so. To be honest, don't think so. Yeah, that's it. Just change a lot, Tycoon. I think you'd have to change a lot of it. Um, as a human, you need to make of <laughs> Yeah, like I, I like it. You know, look, I like Blood Bowl as well. But I'm, I'm just talking about for like you know, the, <laughs> the game is shouldn't be for you know grumpy old bastards to play a board game online, the game should be for cyanide to make profit. <laughs> Shouldn't it? That's, that's the actual, that's what it's for. And I think it would be like, you know, it would survive more on everything if more people were playing and what have you. And I think you'd have to dumb it down for that. I think they should, I think dumbing it down would benefit cyanide and then therefore benefit us who what play it because then um, there'd be more people playing it, wouldn't there? Oh, that was an annoying annoying fucking fail. So was that. I'm blitzing on our block, what the fuck has the world come to? Doesn't matter. Bad luck, get fucked. He's got two dice easy, haven't he? 
Don't think I want to move the snots. Ah, oh, well, he can just run through here at the moment, can't he? I just want to spread them out so that he can't can't hit more than like base more. Herp derp, base, base, base. Don't, I don't want a fucking the ogres to die. Is the problem, isn't it? And if that means snotlings die, then so be it, I guess. Oh, every time I don't have the reroll, I just roll a fucking one. Fuck off, man. That's really fucking annoying, isn't it? <sighs> yeah. No, Red Joker, look, I prefer it like this, but I would also prefer to be playing a dumbed-down version of Blood Bowl than Blood Bowl completely dying out, you know, on online. That literally means that's what we want. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, that's it, yeah. 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 I I agree, Tycho on oh God. I I agree, you know. I I agree. It's the reason why all games are shit and mobile games make more make way more money than everything, like there was Thomas Perinen who uh, who used to work for Games Workshop. He posted a thing where like, um, well, I'm not going to use my reroll in a dodge, am I? <laughs> or do you mean the dodge reroll because he's a chaff with tackle? Um, how else than I eighty nine? Uh, Yeah, he was saying that some fucking shitty mobile company, I don't even know what they were, what it was, um, some fucking shithead mobile game, like Clash of Kings, I think it was Clash of Kings or something, um, they, they were like worth ten times as much as uh, Rockstar or something, it was, I'm not even Rockstar, Take, Take Two or whatever, whatever the fuck, whoever the fuck owns Rockstar. Like whoever the fuck makes Clash of and Clash of Kings is like the only game they make. It was it's something like that anyway. <laughs> it was like fucking outrageous. Shitty mobile games, man. It, like it's just stupid. I think it's just dumb that shitty mobile games make way more than like actual real computer games. So maybe they just shouldn't make Blood Bowl at all. Yeah, Clash of Clans. Uh, I guess, yeah. Same difference. Clash of Clash of Bollocks. I can't believe I fucking rolled a one on that dodge. Fuck's sake. Right. Block with block. Oh, he's got to stand for that. Maybe just blitz the uh Hobgob then. I don't hate it. I was gonna blitz the bull. But actually thinking about it, I need men advantage, I don't I? and I've just fucking threw one away there. But with a man advantage, got half a chance. He's guard, so
Hmm. Not good. Yeah, well, there you go, Mr. Yemendum. Yeah, refine the mechanics of PC, yeah. Yeah, exactly all of them, yeah. Ah, block doing something. Greeting rerolls, what the fuck? Yeah, impact of removals is the biggest one, isn't it? I don't really know what I'm proposing or anything. I just think that that Cyanide shouldn't have been obsessed about making sure people who play tabletop like Blood Bowl 2, you know? I just think that they should. I no, fuck. I fucked it up. I'm not because I want to blitz him so I can block him. Because I can't. Well, I can block him, I guess. I blitz him. I really want to be able to hit the. Hit him, don't I? Which is pushing this guy with block. Oh baby. Could be good. Blitz him and then get the ogre in. One, two, three, four, five. GFI, GFI. <laughs> that could actually be good, couldn't it? Right, try this one first. Three dice. I quite like this idea actually now of three dice in this guy. Ah, oh, you fucking cunt. I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm sorry. I'm trying to play again Blood Bowl at the same time. If if I had a if I had a pet zunk, I could I could get him to talk about what I'm trying to think. But it's really hard to try and think about stuff. Yeah, that's true. Try that's true. That's very true. That half the things people want to change aren't even uh, for the casuals. Well, no, you say that though, but hmm. It's interesting. Yeah, crazy lady, yeah. <laughs> Bastard. Uphill fucking blocking. What a fucking cunt. Hmm. So he's still down, so he can he can get freed up. Yeah. 
to not do much. I can just stand these up first. Block seems good. Letting him seems good as well. But also blitzing him's good. And that would be three dice, wouldn't it? And that means this move can be done first. Fouling, plus two. I think I need to cover against the potato more though, at this point. Not that bad where he is. Guess it's not worth standing him up. I mean, I've only got two guard ogres. It's not like it's not fucking crazy, is it? I've only got two guard. Yeah, XCOM is popular. It's not less complicated. Well, it, it's not less complicated, but it's a lot easier to play, isn't it? <laughs> oh, fuck off, man. It's a lot easier to just have a game of, uh, of, of XCOM. You can just crush the computer and, like, you know. It's, it is a lot easier. I don't think it's a lot easier to just play a game of XCOM. Is there three guard? Oh, fuck off! Is there three guard? No, it's just two. It's just two guard. It'll have three when, when this guy gets guard, but it's just two at the moment. Just opens his turn with a fucking uphill fucking power. Prick. Right. I think this this guy wants to blitz a, a fucking shitter, doesn't he? He wants to block him. He wants to block. No, I could block him free, but he couldn't go through to hit the ball. Or even now to hit him. So I think three dice this guy again. Or not. And two dice him. Or not. Now I just have to not activate him. He has to replace <laughs> where the other one was. Time, isn't he? He's only got three turns. 
Got two snots back. Yeah, that's that's exactly yeah, exactly Crystal Hunter, yeah. It's it's easier to play a game with XCOM even if it is more complicated, if it is. Um That's the thing, you can you can just you can have a game against the AI of XCOM and that can't you? Like it. You can have a mission. People like the missions, don't they? XCOM. Right, finally his re-rolls are gone. And he's on the limit of scoring. Oh man, these one dices are killing me! Fuck! The loner gets the power, you fucking shitting me. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. Uh, uh, to be, yeah, like it's easy to just do a mission of XCOM and. Even though it's like the fucking research is the fucking thing that pisses me off with XCOM. But, um. You know, it's easy to, uh. Oh, I can free this guy up, can't I? Um. With a block. So he wants to come in here. No, he's fucking stand firm. Ah, you shithead. It's a blocking doesn't really achieve anything. He could dodge away and base him or something. I like the idea of dodging to there, and if it's a four, do the break tackle in to hit him. Quite like that idea. I mean, this is a two dice with blocks, so it's pretty safe, isn't it? You might be a complete idiot and not use stamp for. So put these two here, and then go for the blitz with him. I'll just recover him, I guess. Ah, it was a success. So now I can get in. And fuck him up. Fend got us though. <laughs> Fucking Fend. I hadn't used break tackle yet. I could have made the dodge and GFI. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. Oh fuck. Well, he's only got two turns anyway, so it's still hard for him. But fuck, that was stupid. I just realised I rolled a six. Oh shit. So yeah, I should have. I should have GFI'd. Got another break tackle. Got another break tackle. Still have the reroll. Fuck. Fuck, that was stupid. Oh, that was so bad. I hadn't used the break tackle. Still hadn't used Break Tackle. Should have realised I'd used Roll the Six. I just thought, oh, I can't dodge, but I could have dodged. And if there was an Ogre there... I mean, it's still hard for him, isn't it? Can he still score with this guy? Probably. Four, five, six, double GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, he still can still... Fucking fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck, that was bad. It's really hard fucking thinking about... Talking this shit and playing shit at the same time. It's fucking hard. <sighs> yeah, maybe we're done, Yeah, maybe. 
Maybe. Yeah, maybe Squirrel Dude. Maybe Frenzy would have been better, yeah. Alright, good. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter that I fucked it. Good. There's only this guy who can score. And he can't score anyway. So, good. I literally don't care, do I? Because he just can't score. So, so fuck it. <laughs> Thanks, Kurgo. Yeah, it's hard. It's hard to. Uh, I did activate him. Yeah, I activated him and he boneheaded again. Last turn. Yeah, exactly, BB Snow. It's so much easier to just have somebody else talking for you while you play. Like, it's so much easier. Or just ignore the chat, you know, like like some people do. Could just ignore the chat. That would that would also be possible. Why not reroll? I mean, I could have reroll, but <laughs> why bother? I just didn't care. I could have re-rolled that one though, yeah. You're right, I could have re-rolled that time. I just don't like to. I just don't like to re-roll things. It's kind of like cheating, isn't it? Really? If you'd re-roll things. <laughs> Rerolling is cheating. I mean, I could have re-rolled that, I guess. But I just... Oh, God. I misclicked there. Um, the thing is, I thought, what if I go there and I double double skull it? Or no, push him? Or what if it could chain me somehow is what I was thinking. So I thought I didn't want to risk it. I just thought, what if, what if he can chain me? So I thought, this way I know he can't score. And that's what I was thinking, to be honest. I thought, what if there was some crazy way he could chain me? I'll just go down and it's all right. Saved by a bonehead, yeah, that was fucking horrific, wasn't it? <sighs> Button to the suicide hotline. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, it's fucking, it's tough, it's tough. Because obviously making it, like, more accessible. Making it more accessible, you don't even need to dumb down the actual game. You could even dumb up the actual game by, like, you know, reducing the, the amount of luck that affects it. Because the thing is, look is obviously a massive impact, and it's easy for new players to look at the look impact and think it's just dumb and there's no point. So that puts people off. Having having so much luck in Blood Bowl does put new people off as well. So um, it's like I've got a PM. I'll, re I'll respond to the PM later, but I can't right now. But um, yeah, it's like. It's fucking tough because you want to just you just want people to be able to pick up and play it, don't you? And and that's the hard thing, really, with Blood Bowl. Because XCOM, you can go on a mission and you fucking understand that you've got to shoot people, and it's fucking obvious. And and they've got they've got the fucking tutorial that just takes you through an easy mission where you just shoot guns at people, and uh, you know, and it's just XCOM just takes you through, guides you through the first mission easily, doesn't it? So how do you fucking how do you fucking guide people through a game of Blood Bowl? It's not fucking easy, is it? So I think that would be the biggest thing. 
I think the biggest thing would just be, you know, having a good way to intro it. Um, would be the biggest thing for Blood Bowl. So maybe he's not necessarily dumb it down, but I wouldn't mind if it was dumbed down. I don't think every rule has to be like this exactly the same as tabletop, although I would like it less. You know, if it would make other people like it more, I think it would be worth it. You know, if it would make like beginners like it more, then it, but then how would you know with this? So, you know, I wouldn't trust Cyanide or basically anybody to make those changes, but. <laughs> If it made it not Blood Bowl, I wouldn't, I wouldn't really care if it made it more popular. But I guess it would never be that popular as well, because it is. But then, having said that, fucking that game that was like Madden, Mutant League Football, is actually pretty mainstream, wasn't it? Although it was just Madden. It was just reskinned Madden. Um, it was pretty popular. So, like, it could be. It could be kind of a lot more popular Blood Bowl, I think. But anyway... Um, that was good, wasn't it? Beating Chofs. 2 0 against Chofs right now. Um, and 2 1 0, you sure noticed before making moves. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.